What we're going to do now is we're going to install a review plugin. That means that when you write your review, you can also give a certain amount of stars to that product so people can see the rating of this product. So to do that, you are going to log into your WordPress backend again, and then go to uh, plugins here, click on plugins. And then at the top, you see a button add new. So we're going to install a review or rating plugin in the search. Uh, results here at the right side, the search area here, we're going to uh, type yet another star rating. And then you will see this plugin here. Um, you can click on it and you can see what kind of plugin this is. You see, uh, here's a description. But what you're going to do is just click on this install button or in this install button that you're seeing right here. So now it's installing this plugin, it's installed. The only thing we have to do is activate this. And once it's activated, we're going to configure this. Now, here it says, hey, Tim, never miss an important update. Opt in to our security feature updates, notification, and non-sensitive sensitive diagnostic tracking. Um, you can skip this if you want. And then go straight to your review plugin. Now, here you can configure some settings. Um, you can choose to auto insert this plugin. Uh, personally, I won't do that, but because sometimes maybe you want to write post that is not about the product, so you don't want to give it a star rating. Um, and here you can choose the size of the stars. Um, let me see. Um, this can all be disabled. Show overall ratings in archive page. Um, also disable it, this everywhere. Um, you can type some custom text in here. This, this is all not needed. Let me see. Here it says, do you want show stats for visitor votes? We're going to put that to no because we don't want to have visitor votes to our plugin. Now here also allow only logged in user to vote. Here it says everybody, we're going to change that to only logged in users that may vote. Uh, do you want to save IP addresses? No. Uh, rich snippet. Now this is the nice part, a rich snippet option. Uh, which rich snippet do you want to use? When you click this button, you see exactly what this plugin does and why we also want this on our website uh, because it's going to add these stars to Google. It says rating 4.2 or it says the first one. Uh, when you have a review rating, um, you will have this one the top the top one and when you have a aggregate aggre aggregate rating sorry guys i'm not english uh, you can you will have this one personally uh we want to have this one uh, a review rating just the top one because that's going to give these stars to google that's perfect um select a default item type for all our posts of pages. Well, we have a product that we're going to review. So we're going to keep it this way. We can also keep this way star. So we're going to save our settings. And here we go to multi sets. And here we're going to make a new multi set. So we can type in this area name, we're going to call it rating and we're going to add a few elements and that will make sense once you see it. Because we want to uh, give ratings for the price of this product. We want to give ratings for the quality of this product and we want to give ratings for the easy to use. Uh, you can you can add whatever you want. If you want to add more elements, feel free to do so. In this case, we're just going to use three elements, the price, the quality and the easy to use. And then we're going to create a new set. And as you can see, here's the new set right now uh, that we can use in our review blocks. Now this means when we go, for example, to our website and here's the hello world world post that we're going to delete in a second. But when we click this post, we see this post, uh, there's a post in here with a reply at the top, you can edit this post. And now you will see that here at the bottom, you'll see yet another star rating multiple set. Here we can give star ratings ourselves for the price, as you can see in here. So we can say, okay, the price is five stars, the quality is four stars, and the easy to use is five stars. If we want to add this to our WordPress uh, article, to our review article, uh, we're going to take this one. So if you want to ins insert this multi set, paste this shortcut. We we want to use the multi set. So we're going to paste this 
in here. And now you're going to see what this does when we go to preview changes. You can see that this is added to our review article. So when we type out our review, people will see the price, the quality and the easy to use. So this is the plugin that we're going to use for our uh, yeah for reviews that we're going to write or take videos from. So that's it for this video. Um, you now know how to install your review plugin and this way you also install other plugins. So uh, see you in the next video.